Do you want to spend more time with like-minded people, especially when you're dating? I've got some great tips to help you create a quality circle of friends and find some great people to date. talking about meeting quality people, especially when you're dating. But let's back up. You really need a solid foundation of good friends before you attract a good romantic relationship. So let's talk about both. We all want to feel like we belong, but what if you have a hard time finding people that you click with? Potential friends and great people to date are everywhere and they would love to connect with you. You can never have enough great friends or dates, right? But you do want to focus on quality over quantity. One of the easiest places to make friends is at work. I would say about 90% of my closest friends started out as coworkers. And my husband was coworker. Look around your workplace and see who you'd like to get to know better. Going out to lunch and going out after work with coworkers is a great way to get to know each other and unwind a little bit. You never know who you might click with. I met my husband at work and I have a lot of coworkers who met at work and got married. Meeting new people through friends is easy too. So who do you like to hang out with? Who do they hang out with? Whenever you're invited to go hang out with new people, go. If you go to church or synagogue or some other spiritual gathering, that is a great place to meet like-minded people who share similar beliefs. And you can go to meetup.com. There are so many groups for every interest, topic, hobby, a lot of opportunities to meet new people there and connect with people that you also have similar interests with. And do you go to networking meetings? Look for people that you have common interests with that go beyond that professional setting. When I first started networking, I was looking for real connections and mutual support with women, regardless of what they were doing or what their businesses were. I found a few good friends and a couple of good clients, so keep that in mind when you're in a networking situation. And just remember that everything is all about relationships in every aspect of your life. So let's talk about how you feel when you meet new people, because this is really important. And it's okay to leave a group or an organization if you no longer feel aligned with them. It's also okay to step away from people that you just don't really feel like you jive with anymore too. I've had to do that several times in my life. I'll post a video here explaining what I'm talking about. In any new relationship, authenticity is a priority. You want to connect with people who are genuine and real. Make sure you feel good around anyone you are forming new friendships with. And ladies, I emphasized this in last week's video, but I'm going to say it again. Never blow off your girlfriends for a guy. Okay, you know what I'm saying. I've already gone over that. So just remember to stay alert and pay attention to new people who are coming in and out of your life. You never know who's going to be a good friend or a potential romantic partner. You could go on a date with somebody new and maybe you don't click but maybe you'll be friends. And maybe that person will click with one of your friends. Or maybe one of your friends is dating somebody that they don't click with, but that person is a good match for you. You never know. Stay open to everything, but just make sure it feels good. Make sure that you feel a connection, that you feel like you have things in common, that you enjoy being around this person, you get a good vibe from them. Those intuitive feelings are really important, whether we're talking about friendships or dating and romantic relationships. Always trust your gut. So just remember, potential new friends are everywhere. You just need to stay open. You never know where you might meet your tribe. I hope this helps you expand your circle of friends or maybe make some new ones if you've started a new job or moved to a new area. If you follow any of these tips, you will be well on your way to creating a great new group of friends or adding to your existing group of friends and finding great people to date, maybe even your soulmate. Did you like this video? Let me know by clicking the thumbs up, leaving your comments below, and sharing with your friends. I look forward to reading your comments and helping you find more great friends. You can count me among them. For the best information about Law of Attraction and Holistic Living, subscribe to my channel and hit the bell to be notified every time I post a new video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Why can't I say that sentence? Can you hear that? <sighs> I'm not just, I don't like the way that sounds. I forgot what else I was going to say.